Okay, and welcome back to the channel. On this video, as you take a look at the Lyric Graffiti, we're going to talk about the Lyric Graffiti. But it's a different Lyric Graffiti we're going to talk about. Not this one right here. Because this one here is sold out and they're changing up some things on the bike. And I'm going to talk about that. So the one I have, they call it now the 2022 Lyric Graffiti, which as I say, is sold out. And they have some changes on it. And I'm going to talk about that. So first thing, the frame and everything is basically the same. Uh, the frame, the wheels, are the same the where the differences are going to be is the motor is completely different so the motor on the new graffiti is a 1000 watt rear geared hub motor and it will peak though at 2300 watts so it's got uh still it's got a lot of a lot of oomph And I guess it helps if I put up my kickstand. I forgot to put it. I wonder what that was. I don't think I've done that before, but now I have. Anyway, so 2300 watts, and it's a 52 volt still. But 2300 watt peak, that's pretty good because my. Uh, Aerial Rider Grizzly, it's a dual motor, but each motor peaks at 1850 watts, and they're a thousand watt, 52 volt. And the controller, I believe, is a 30 amp controller on the uh, Aerial Rider Grizzly. Of course, it has one for each motor. And on the new graffiti, the 2023 graffiti, they have a 33 amp controller. So I think, and they're saying top speed is 33 miles per hour. And I think you're gonna easily get the 33 because the, uh, if you run just one motor on the Aerial Rider Grizzly, the top speed is about 34 miles an hour on that one somewhere in there, maybe, uh, yeah, 34, I believe, maybe 35, 34. There's not much difference in speed, really, when you do two motors. It's just quicker acceleration and uh, more uh, hill climbing power. But uh, so anyway, uh, with the with that set up there and a 2300 watt peak and the bike weight is only 59 pounds without batteries and each battery if you have one or two and we'll talk about batteries in just a moment but if you have the one battery uh that would be an extra nine pounds and two batteries obviously is 18 pounds so even at that with two batteries you're still going to only be about 78 pounds or uh, 77 pounds, I should say. Uh, so that's pretty lightweight. And let's talk a little bit about the batteries on the bike. So the batteries are changed up too. Instead of the uh, 17 and a half amp for uh, 52 volt, uh, let's see, 17 and a half amp, it was, a six, it was 18 650 cells. Well, they've changed that up now to the, it's a Samsung 21700 cells, and it's 20 amp now, the batteries. So you have an option of getting one or two. And we'll talk about the prices, uh, uh, the price of the bike in a little bit. Uh, some of the other things about this bike, so it has the same thing about uh, on-road and off-road, a switch. 
where on road obviously is 20 miles per hour and off road as I mentioned you can go up to 33 and maybe even a bit more than that because like I say the Lyric Graffiti weighing even with two batteries 77 pounds while well, the Grizzly is 105 and so there's quite a bit of weight difference too so I think you're going to get that 33 you might even get up it up up to uh, 35 even possibly but they're saying 33 and we'll go with that battery uh, range 35 to 40 miles per battery so if you have the one battery set up you're going to get 35 to 40 if you have the two you're going to get 70 to 80 and Let's see what else it's still got the belt drive such same as this bike has and the light setup is the same thing I believe it's the exact same with the really nice headlight here and tail light and brake light no signal lights it does have the two passenger seat and the pegs for a second uh, rider free shipping on the bike that's something else Except for if you're in, this is for US and Canada, if you're not in, uh, if you're in the 48 lower states, if you're in Alaska or Hawaii, you can still get the bike and you're just gonna have to pay extra. I don't know how much the uh, difference is, you'd have to contact them about that. The display for the bike is going to be, uh, they've got the APT uh, 860C, it's a color display. Pedal assist, nine levels. It's gonna have the uh, front suspension, but no rear, it's a hard tail. The uh, seat height is a really nice seat height. It's 31 inches. I like this seat height for myself because being five foot nine, to, to me, this is the absolute perfect height because my feet just touch the ground which I like. I know some people like a uh, higher seat, but I like it where I can get my feet down on the ground if I need to, uh, um, you know, it's easier for me to handle the bike when I can put my feet flat. I like that better. Uh, let's see, it does come with a 52 volt, three amp charger. One charger. Uh, and the brakes are, uh, we no longer are going to have regen braking because it's a geared motor as opposed to gearless so they uh, no longer have that and it's a four piston uh, hydraulic brakes which is nice and I think that's just about all of it I should mention too that the uh, in the off-road uh, on-road mode the bike is 750 watts, peaks at uh, 1,000, and then when you put it to the off-road, you'll get the 1,000 watt and a peak of uh, 2,300 watts. And I think that's just about all of it. It does come in three different colors. One is uh, called Sergeant. One is called Eclipse, and then there's the Vanilla. So, uh, I'll leave a link in the display, or in the, in the display, I'll leave it in the, uh, I'll leave it in the description. And you can go and check it out. The price, Oh, uh, the price for the one battery setup is $25.99 and if you want the dual which would be uh, 40 that would be 20 amp hour for the one battery or the dual is a 40 amp uh, 52 volt and the dual is it's a $29.99 for the dual and $25.99 for the single battery I think personally it's worth the extra $400 to get that second battery. Uh, let's see. I should also mention that 
if you uh, you uh, want to take a look at the bike I will leave a link in the description like I said and I will uh, if you use my uh, link there it'll get you there and then if you do want to decide to buy a bike it will get you $150 off the purchase of a bike when you use the code discount code Oregon eBiker Mark all one word and not only is that code good for the graffiti but it's also good for any bike on Lyric Cycles uh, website so maybe you're interested in the ghost or the voodoo or perhaps you're looking at the bike that's coming out in the future uh, the graffiti X you can't order that yet but uh, that will be coming uh, by the fall hopefully and one more uh, note on the bike the new graffiti if you uh, purchase it now they're expecting to ship them out in July so you wouldn't have to wait too long and as I mentioned the shipping will be free so go check out the uh, site as I say I, I left the description or will leave one in the uh, a link in the description I should say and you can go check it out for yourself see what you think personally I like the Eclipse color the best which would be the black and teal but I don't mind any one of the colors they all look okay but if I had a preference and had to choose one I would probably uh, choose that I would choose that the black and teal I think that looks really sharp uh, Now, obviously, I haven't ridden the new graffiti, but if it handles in any way like this bike here, you're going to get yourself a pretty nice bike. And the price is a little lower, so you might be it might be a little more affordable for you. And I think if it were me and I'm buying that bike, I'm buying the extra battery for $400. I think that's a good deal for a 20 amp hour, 52 volt battery. But maybe you're not gonna travel far, you know, you're gonna do short rides and you don't need all that battery. So maybe the 35 to 40 mile range is enough for you. All right, well, that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you very much for coming along for the ride. If you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, hit the subscribe button. Thank you for doing that. And also, if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. Uh, if you want to comment on this or any other video, go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section. Once again, thank you for joining me on this video. And until next time, take care.